41 NBC Sports continues inside the end zone. Well, it's always a lot of fun when two of the best programs in our viewing area play each other in a non-region game that happened tonight in Forsyth as Mary Persons hosted Washington County. Tucker Sargent's here with more. Yeah, last year this game was not close at all. Of course, mm -hmm. Washington County winning 31-0 in Sandersville. Mary Persons hoping to move to 2-0 on the season. Waco hoping to avoid its first 0-2 start since 2007. Mary Persons looking for its first win over Washington County since 1993. Here come the visiting Golden Hawks and straight out of the pit, the Mary Persons Bulldogs. Mary Persons goes right to work. Zach Harvey, 5, 10, 15, almost 20 yards and a first down for the Bulldogs. Then Harvey again, two big runs for the junior on the dog's opening drive. They ended up in a fourth down situation. Harvey finds his way into the end zone. Extra point good, seven nothing Bulldogs. Waco goes to work. First play for the Hawks and play action. Houston Chanel to Marquevis Latimer. Down to the 20, but the Hawks would have to go for it on fourth down. Watch this catch by Latimer. Way up there, touchdown. Tied at seven. Mary Persons drives the length of the field. Second and goal from the three for the Bulldogs. The Waco defense blows it up, Bill. A perfect scoop and score for Preston Daniels. That's a freshman. 97 yards. Hawks in the lead, 14-7 after the extra point. Mary Persons answers, so it's 14-14 here. The Bulldogs going with some play action. Wheel route, guess who? Zach Harvey, watch him put his hand up. Got to be careful there, Zach. Could have had it stripped. He does score the touchdown, but watch Coach Brian Nelson afterward. Mary Persons led 21-14 at the half, and the Bulldogs won to win this game 38-14. And after the game, I spoke with the winning coach, Mary Persons, Brian Nelson. And a, a much different outcome than last year in Sandersville. Yeah, a little bit. You know, we were we were still pretty sloppy with with hanging on to the football, a couple penalties. Uh, but I thought overall our kids hung in there, a lot of adversity. They played hard, uh, were pretty physical, and, um, you know, happy to get this win. I'm sure you're, you're glad to, to be 2 over as a young team. What does it mean to beat a, a, a team like Washington County coached by a coach like Joel Ingram? Well, you know, me and Joel are good friends, and he's a heck of a football coach. And, of course, they got a history and tradition. Um, you know, we're happy where we're at. we got a long way to go. Um, just just mistakes, and we got to clean stuff up, all stuff we can fix. But, um, you know, we got to do a whole lot better job. The Bulldogs will visit Lamar County next week. Waco 0 oh 2. Mm, first time in a long time. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> All right, thanks, Tucker. We'll have the scoreboard right after this.